In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform the bear hug test to diagnose partial and full thickness subscapularis tendon tears. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. The bear hug test is an easy way to assess strength and pain in a subscapularis. According to an EMG study done by Panog et al. in the year 2011, the bear hug test activated the subscapularis to the same degree as the belly press and the liftoff test while minimizing pectoralis, lat and teres major action that are more active in resisted internal rotation in the zero position. Different studies have evaluated the bear hug test and have found a varying sensitivity from 19.1% to 75% and a specificity ranging from 56% to 99%. You can find all the individual studies in the description down below. Across all of the studies, the sensitivity was rather weak and the specificity values were moderate to high, which makes the test moderately useful to confirm a subscapularis tendon tear in practice. To perform the test, have the patient stand and ask him to put the palm of the involved side on top of his contralateral shoulder with his fingers extended and the elbow positioned anterior to the body. Then the patient tries to hold the starting position by means of resisted internal rotation as the examiner tries to pull the patient's hand from the shoulder with an external rotation force applied perpendicular to the forearm. This test is positive if the patient is not able to keep his hand on his contralateral shoulder or if the patient reports recognizable shoulder pain. All right, this was our video on the bear hug test for subscapularis tendon tears. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. All of this information and much more can be found on our online courses on study.physiotutors.com. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.